don't have a clue about them spiral exactly. rock. I don't know, I watched that full 15 minute video, I was like... Still... So you know when you come to the roundabout? Mm -hmm. And you go on to the roundabout, it spirals out to the left, that's what they do, they spiral out to the left. So if you're going right to the roundabout and it spirals out to the left and it's easy, you can use that, they didn't guess which one you go to. The middle. The middle one, that's it, so it just spirals out. So you just go to the left one. You're not changing lanes or anything, it's just you've got the choice of lanes and when it spirals in two, you just keep it the left one. Don't worry, I'm not worried about that at the moment, we'll come back to that. Um, <clears throat> right, get yourself in. Are you sure these are going to need these, did you? Tell me how they said correct. I'm a bit worried when you just look and then don't adjust them. You can see the corner of the door handle and the finger width from there. Right, is that what it's like? Yep. You could put your clutch down then. Are you comfy? Right, now you have to do, if you change your seat then you've got to do your mirrors again, haven't you? Fingers where the car, you're going to need these, well you need them all the time, but today is more important, the most important one. So, four subjects today, joining dual carriageways, leaving dual carriageways, overtaking on dual carriageways, and keeping the two second gap. So we'll start with joining, what's it say on the video? Joining. Yeah, what have you, you got to do with your speed? Uh, match the speed on the dual car. Good, car. and then you're going to keep left, Ian. If you see a car small in the dormer, what are you going to do? Move into the lane. If Move it's not lane. getting bigger. What happens if it's getting bigger? Uh, let it get past. Yeah, just let it get past. Just take your foot off the gas. So we're going to come down the slip road. We might be missing gears out the deer. Going from first to third, third to fifth, second to fourth, fourth to sixth. Okay, just depends. So you're going to come down the left and you're going to match your speed there. You're going to put your signal on, and then when you come down there, you're either going to speed up, come off the gas, whatever. You got that? Yeah. Any questions about that? No. Consider it a sideways glance if you're not 100% sure about joining. Okay, but if you match your speed to theirs, you won't have a problem. When we get onto the carriageway, when you go onto the three lane carriageway, what's the middle lane for? Cruising. Cruising? Oh yeah, I don't know. I know the right lens for like overtaking. Yeah, the right lens for overtaking. So what's the middle one for? It's going to go on the speed. Overtaking. So if you're not overtaking, you keep to the All right. left. When we do overtake, use your mirrors, couple of dormer checks, get the signal on nice and early, get past as quick as you can. And how do you know when to move back to the left? What does it say on the video? Once uh, you can see the headlights. In the middle mirror. Yeah. Now, um, there you probably would need a dormer check, but just check it anyway because sometimes it might be overtaken from the right lane. Yeah. And you're going to, in the third lane, you're going to move back to the left. So when you see the headlights move back to the left. Now, when you're on the f these fast moving roads, how do we judge that two second gap? Tell me how we judge it. It was something about like, look, like saying something in your head or something wasn't it? count to two seconds i say that rhyme only a fool breaks the two second rule because it takes two seconds to say that what you need to do you can line the car up in front with the stationary object um, i'll tell you what i do for quickness when you're driving when the car in front is level with that white line i use that as my marker point then i'll count to two seconds i say that rhyme only a fool breaks the two second rule now if i've said that and I've not reached that marker point, does that mean it's I've got a good gap or is it too close? Got a good gap. If I say only fill brakes and I've reached the marker point, you too too fast. Too close, aren't you? Now there's one tip I can give you is that when you go in the carriage, a lot of drivers drive too close to each other. And um, what happens to the gap in wet weather? Uh doubles. Doubles, icy conditions. It goes to like twenty seconds, doesn't it? Ten, isn't it? Ten times. Now, when we leave the carriage wheel, <coughs> if you're doing 70, when should you signal? Oh, I can't remember the 70. I remember the 50 we'll was 200. Well, if the 50 is 200, what's well, the 70? 70 is obviously 300. Just the fast you go at the early signal. Now, when you leave, the, when you're on the boots on your foot now, um, so you know when people want to join. 
Yeah. What three wheels can you do with it? So imagine you're all on the carriage and the car comes down and wants to join the carriage. What can you do with it? And just keep keep going at your normal speed or slow down. You could slow down and let them get in. What's the other one? Speed off. Good. And the final one? Uh, just go as normal, surely. Or move over to the right. You move over the right hand lane. When we leave the roundabout, um, slow down on the slip road okay don't slow down too much on the carriage wheel right and um, we're going to get to the a19 it's a horrible road um do you want a bit of help to start with them yeah yeah and then we'll if it goes all right we'll move on to the um the spiral roundabouts oh, and once we've done a couple they're not too bad comfy sure yeah start your car put your window up you didn't do any crazy stuff last week, did you? No. Good. <clears throat> Is your mum getting out the door? The door? No. I can see why you don't look all around there. There's nothing there, is it? So go to your mini roundabout and turn left. Set reservation and emerge right across what we've done last week. Leave the gear a bit later. I thought I was doing a roll on first. Well, I want to do a roll on first though, but if it was safe to go. So if you can't go, you do a roll on first though, you can't see. But I would be dropping that into second on approach and looking to go. And if I can't go, then I'd do the road at first. If it was a closed junction, I would just do the road at first. You know the skipping gears, how does that work? Do you just obviously match the speed? Yeah, because you're going down the steep hill. Oh, you will really? probably do third or fifth or second or fourth. You wouldn't do it going uphill, would you? No. Because what would happen to the car? It just wouldn't work, would it? It'd slow right down, wouldn't it? Try going uphill. We've not done 70 yet, have we? No, I haven't been in 6 gear yet. Oh, but do you know what that 6 gear is? Because I don't I hate going into 5th gear. I'm, Are you? I'm just bad at it. You must be forcing it. I am, I'm really bad at it. So, well, we're going in a lot today. So when you do it, you just put in your impose across. So you, you know this um, crossroads will be here. Yeah. It's slightly offset, so just keep it to the centre line. Please. Would I go down the same? It's a, it's a close junction, isn't it? Yeah, so you could go from 4th to 1st. What do you reckon it's better to 
lean forward if you can't see properly. Stop with the white length. Are oh, you pulling off really well again? So yeah, going back to the spiral roundabout, so when you come red, you come round about and it says you turn right and it splits into two lanes, which one's the best one to pick? The middle. The middle. If you go into the roundabout and it spirals to the left, you pick the left of the two, normally. Oh, that didn't feel right. Joe, how quick it come up? Oh, no. Not good, not good. Did you do cope with these alright? Yeah. Might be able to see these. That car safe. Can you remember your position over there? Right in the middle of the... Down the grass verge. And I'll go after this right one. It's your decision. He's going fast in. You made the correct decision, I wouldn't have gone either. A bit further forward, that'll do. Lovely. See that part there. Busy? No.
feel like you're going down. I don't know, it, it, it just does. But back and forth. Back and fifth. Right. You got it? Yeah. Good. Now, honestly, if it does feel like I'm going like down, it might it? be how I'm doing it with my hand. You know when you do the way, when you try to do wrong, you're going off at like two yeah. o'clock instead of going to three o'clock, you're going to like one o'clock instead of going to three. Tell me how many seconds is between us and this mini. I need the wheel up or off. White line and count. Two seconds. It's about three seconds up. This is, yeah. Try it now. Only if it breaks the two second rules. So that's two seconds. So you don't get any closer. When you see the cars join. Yeah. Let's take it for off your gas. That's it. So that's one tip I give you is that keep that two second gap. So this is about, how many seconds would you say this is between us and the Mini? Probably four. It is, you're probably right. And remember, in wet weather, it goes to four seconds. Gap. Dry conditions, two seconds. <clears throat> Keep your gas on to get up this hill. Otherwise, we're going to struggle again. That's about two seconds, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, that was a bit sunny, wasn't it? Bloody hell. Yeah, and this is about many, this is about four or five, isn't it? Or something like that. Try your fifth gear again. That looked neat. Very think, neat the way you've done it there. I think I've got it now. It's good. Yes. Yeah, it definitely feels like I'm going down. Is it? Yeah, it doesn't feel like I'm going to the, to the right. Sounds a bit weird, that, but... It's probably how I'm, yeah, it'll be how I'm doing it with my hand. But the, there, you just put little movements, and yeah. it goes in very easy. You just like treat the gear like, like pea soup. Like, that's all over the place. Look well ahead, tell me what signs you see down here. Driving your car? No, I don't. I don't like going in this. Why? When, when I'm not when I'm driving, going from yours to oh, mine. Because right. this is proper smooth. Is it? Yeah, compared to mine, it is. But your car's proper smooth. It's just you're ragging the life out of it. Your footwork and your gears probably. Now at the roundabout, follow the signs for Sunderland North. Which way is that? Left. Left at the roundabout. Controlled by traffic lights. Oh, there's two lights for going that way. Just an arm. Let's now be ready. What could these lights do? Yeah. Have a look at this car behind the pretty claws. Right, I missed third gear up, go to fourth. Just go up and down. Put your clutch down, you plonk it. That's it. Right, give us more gas. Now they're doing about, oh, what would you say, 50, 60? Yeah. Get your foot out there. Go on, faster. Go on, get your foot out. Use your dormer and pop your signal on. Oh, we've got a great big juice. You keep left. Have a look at your dormer. Can you join? Yeah. Good. Now, drift it in. Keep your gas on, though. Don't worry about that car. That car's expecting you to join. Cancel it. Tell me how many seconds this is. Probably about two. It is. That's as close as you want to get. It's busy for you. It's good practice for you, this. Oh, I'm going to go on to the fifth. This scene here just reminds me of Fast and Furious. Fast and Furious, where them just roll off the back of this. Shut up, man. <laughs> Got nowhere to go there, have you? Oh, when you overtake wagons like this, you look for a clean overtake, okay? You don't sit side by side with them, you get a clean overtake. Now, we're going to be leaving at the next exit. What 
Okay, you do I go down and leave? I think, yeah. No, it says quarter, half a mile ahead, yeah? Yeah. Keep your gas on. This is a dangerous road, this one. I've seen lots of accidents on this one. So we're looking for the countdown markers, and when we're going to see them, second one. It's 200 yard mark. So this is the third one. Yes. Now when we leave the slip road, when we leave the dual carriage, we're going to leave in the right lane. We'll keep your gas on. It's a signal now. Yes. Now we're going to leave in the right lane because we're going to turn right the roundabout and come all the way back round. Now I'll help with the roundabout because it comes fuzzes the life out of the road. So leave in the right lane. I want to reduce speed. Not yet. When you get into the slip road, start reducing it. Tell people where you're going. roundabout I want you to choose the right lane again and then when we go around the corner it's going to stop at the white lane you plugger where are you going to stop then? Yeah? you were going to stop at the gateway lines weren't you? Know. right off you go so just keep it to the right now be ready these what lights could you yes keep it to the right now keep it come off your gas give me time to explain this Right, when you come round here, it's going to spiral out into two lanes when you go around. Put your signal back on. I want you to keep your signal on for right, put it in first and get the lamp ring on. I want you to bear out to the, go around the right, but keep to the left lane as you go around. So keep the signal on for right. Use your left door mirror now. Left door mirror. Now keep the middle lane. See how it spirals out to the left? That's way it does. I know. What colours them lights on? Right. Signal back on. Now we're going round to the right again and just don't lose your lane now. Where's your back up line? Keep to this lane, don't lose it. And we want the, uh, where the van's going. Make sure when you take it off, it goes to the floor. Don't you know how close has that been for you? Mm. Well, don't throw your clutch at us, I'll go in the back of us. Tell people to leave it. Right, let's have a look at how fast they're going on the slip road first of all. This fourth out and go to fifth gear. Nice, right, get your foot out. Use your door mirror. Pop that signal on. Tell me what you're going to do. Check mirrors. Right, what you gonna say, exactly just get your foot out. There's nothing in the right lane. What do you mean you couldn't see? Is that mirror set correctly? Yeah, no, it's because I, I was blocked. You weren't blocked. Was BMW was behind you. Go on and try six gear. You've never been in, have you? It's gone. What? It's down, isn't it? That's it. <laughs> you, took, you went in the fifth, took it out of the fifth, put it back in the fifth. What's that all about? Oh, it's an art. Just keep the press left and down, isn't it? Uh, leave me at the next exit, half a mile ahead. And next slip road, can you do it on your own? Yeah. I don't know what you were saying about being blocked. You should have been look, you're looking at you look to see what was in this lane, not what was behind you. I could see it was clean to join. Now keep it to the left a bit more and look for your countdown markers. Now leave in the right lane again. Lane on the roundabout. They've 
done all this now, so I'm not sure how it works out, so we'll have to have a look as we get round the corner. You just keep the right lane and look for A19 North. You won't see A19 North yet, but you will when you get round there. Experts call these gyatory round What's our going keep this left right, one? Right, Just keep right. Keep right. Ah, see, now that we should have gone to the right, but it wasn't like that last week. Will you see my back up to right? Keep right. Use your left door mirror. You just have to have to come in this lady in the middle one. Tell people you're going to leave the roundabout. What now? Yes. And we're going to have to leave in the right lane. So when we come round there, it's split into two lanes. But it wasn't roadmarked to say that we could go to that lane, so we couldn't take it. But when we got round, it was roadmarked. So now we know we're a little bit local knowledge. And we've got a dash coming, look. So you, we normally leave in the left, but because these are all coming down left, we're going to leave in the right lane. We're going to try and get back to the left lane, which is going to be quite tricky, actually. So you're going to have to put your foot on going down the slip road. Otherwise you're going to look like a right pair of legs. See where the blue car's going? Yeah. You need to do the same. Same go on, straight again. Cancel it. Get your foot out. Keep away from this car. Miss fourth on. Now use your door mirror. Pop a signal. It's all yours. Get your foot out. And remember, don't join on the solid white line. So it's better to do it from the left lane because you get a bit of picture. Yeah. Do you understand that one? Yeah. Good, right. So now we're going to try a spot of overtaking. Oh, cares. And we're going to hit the 70 mark and we get some overtake. When the lights is working you stop at the solid white line but when they're not working you stop at the thing give me a laugh yeah. Yeah. now just go around in the right lane and when it sp splits into two pick the left is that my back up there yeah it is mm. over here yeah yeah 70 mm. magical Quite busy, considering. That's how old I feel after a driving lesson with you. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> hmm? I'll be ready because the next set of lights could change. Being ready means lifting off the gas as you come around. Take off the gas. Be ready. I was through that. Use your left door. Where am I going? 
middle in. Keep it up for me. See what I mean by I know, but I was through the there though. That wasn't bad. It could have stopped. I'd been on a muck test again. You see, it was full for that point. You see them back up. Really? Yeah. Steady am, it means stop unless you're too close. If you did stop, it could cause an accident. Do you want to one in? Uh, into the right lane. This is the one in front of you. So we just lead you off the roundabout now. So you're having to do the carriage wheels on your own now. Yeah. yeah? Are you going to get into first? Are you going to miss, it's up to you if you miss skis out if you want. It's your choice, but I'll pass responsibility over to you now. I'll only in prompt if I see you trying to do something crazy, okay? Yeah. Signal on for right. Now use your left door mirror for me now. See how it's splitting? Yeah. Just keep it in the middle. Put your signal on for right. But it should have A19 North here also. Oh, Put your signal back on. See how it's got A19 North here? Yeah. A19 North. It's confusing. Like. Put your signal back on. Sunderland Council. Just behind that back. That's it. See, it's better when you've got the choice to pick the left. Put your signal back on. Park and break. <coughs> these are called spiral roundabouts or gyre toy roundabouts. Do you get one of these in your test or not? There's one in Durham, and it's dead easy to do if you do it right. In Sunland, I feel so many people to take the test in Sunland. That's it, ragged in. Left lane. And then keep left and tell people that you leave. Keep left. Maybe more than left is more. Cancel it. Now you can miss fourth out here and fourth out going to fifth gear. Now be careful because they're all bunching up down there. Yeah. Right, get your foot on. 
and try and get some water you can do. It's not rugging the gears or she will make mistakes. Now you've got to back off a bit. Right, let's get some overtake and do it. It's safe to move out. Yeah. Oh, I've lost speed. Just keep it on, we'll leave it for now. I can move out here. No, we haven't got enough speed overtake. We need I'll, to go a lot faster. I'll put my foot down then. Well then, put your foot down. It's not safe, safe now. Whoa. Right now, that, whatever car this is, is proper. Keep your gas on. Just leave it for now. That was a perfect time to overtake. Why didn't you overtake them? Wait, because you're like, oh, we don't have enough speed. Well, you, you can't even just move in the right lane and drive like an old granny, can you? And slow your body down. Can you get out now? Yeah. Go on. Ready. We're going to overtake that wagon up there. Keep your gaps still on. So when you do your thing, you should get past as quick as you can, and then move back to the left as soon as it's safe to do so. Go on, get your foot up, get with me. That's it. Now when you see the bus in the middle mirror, take your foot off the gas now. Can you see it? Yeah. The door mirror just drifted over the gas. We're going here as yeah, well. Yeah, leaving this exit. Leaving the right lane again. when you leave the dual carriage base. Yeah. yeah, when you overtake, you don't want to move out the right lane really slowly and go into traffic. You've got to get your speed up. Maybe it's kind of a bit low gear change. Pardon me, right here. Take your foot off the gas now, come off the gas and be ready, these could change. Use your left door mirror, keep, see it splits into two. Take your foot off the gas again, so we're not rushing up lights and breaking heavy. Does that ticker noise come off?
with all the lights, just expect them to change. I know from local knowledge that they're not going to change, but you should be ready. I keep your signal on for right. See how it splits into two lanes now? Yeah, and I'll go on this one. That's it, but you want your, are you not necessarily changing lanes, but I'd still use that left door mirror. Yeah. But some people just cut across. Now be ready, the lights could change. lead you off the, uh, the left lane, the left lane, because the middle lane became the left lane there. So you won't, don't want the signal for right now. Don't want to put it on for left now? Yeah, I'd be putting it on. It doesn't matter so much because it's light control, but I would still signal to confirm where you're going. Tricky these roundabouts, aren't they? They're oh, just they confuse you. Yeah. Well, they confuse me. They confuse most people. But just remember when it normally when it spirals out into two, just keep it in there. This third out go to fourth. Seven zero on there. It's on right now. Now it is. I use your dormant overtake. Keep it on that seventy. See the headlights in the middle where you use your left over. Left over. That's it. There you go. I need a simple one. Oh, we're going to go straight ahead now. Now we're going to do some more of these spiral roundabouts. Yeah, chaos. Just bear in mind if it splits into two, which one do you pick? The left, like the middle. Sorry. Or the left of the two. Yeah. I was dreading these final roundabouts. I don't know, I just because I watch a video normally after the videos I like properly understand them, mm -hmm. but I just I don't know, I just didn't well, understand. Well, if I can do them, you can do them. Take your foot off the gas and when it's safe to do so I want you to move back to the left lane. Now this is very dodgy this so be very careful. So we need to get back back to the left lane. Now I would consider a sideways glance if you're not hundred percent sure. So you need to start planning. We need to start slowing down, letting this white car get past. Tell people what you're going to do. Keep it at 50. That's it. Now, can you get over? Yeah. Slow down a bit more. Now focus the two second gap. That's it. Keep back. We need a bit more brake on. That's it. I want to do my gear, do you? Are you in sixth? Could I have shot go down or not? Yeah, what well, you know, what speed you're at? 50. Pop it to fourth. That's the Now with the roundabout, we're going to turn right. It's the third exit. You got that? Right. So turn right, third exit. So have a look behind and just keep it to the right. To the right. Now, if you see split into two lanes, which one are you going to pick? Right. Oh, the middle. The middle. Good. So we turn right, third exit. It's for Sunland A1. For Sunland. Split? Uh, yeah. Yeah, so you're going to pick the middle. I want you to count your exits and expect the lights to change. See how it says here? One, two, three, in either lane? Yeah. Now, don't lose your lane on this roundabout. Which lane are you going to go to? Middle. Good. Good, good. Get that part real.
These are some intestinal things. Absolute nightmare. Every time I come to Sunday, I get a feel. <laughs> Get yourself ready because these are going to change your life. I'll pick the middle in. I want you to count the exits also. There's number one. Take your foot off the gas, off the gas in case these change. Now there's number two in front of you. So check your left arm right and just keep it to the keep it to the left. keep it to the left. We know the left lane. That's the middle lane. So you've got to keep it to the left as you go around. It's a good job as well to get that middle lane there. So there you should have you've gone to the left lane. Yes. You should have gone to the left lane, you went and picked the middle one. It's not the middle one, you picked the left. We need to turn right at the roundabout, come all the way back round. So I want to be in the right lane. Yes. Trace our steps and come all the way back up here. Now leave it on. Do your test and sun if you want. See, it's splitting into two lanes over there. Yeah. Which one are you going to pick? Middle. Good. Now be ready because the lights could change. That means come off your gas. See what I mean? So you 
you're not anticipating the lights changing. You want your signal back on. I'm going to get you to do that one. Cross one. Less stressful. What gauge do you need? Where's that parking brake? Don't pull it out. Now don't lose your lane, keep it this lane. That's it, now don't lose it. Whatever you do, do not drift into the right lane. Take your foot off the gas now. Put that signal back on. Don't go into the middle lane now. You want the left lane here as you go around. You want the exit after that one. Don't go into the middle lane. Yay! That's so confusing. No, it's not. It's just you making a comfort, isn't it? Just really it yes. Now, you know that roundabout where you went into the middle lane? Yeah. That, that was exactly the same as that. So we're going to do that one again. No. Just keep left, because you've got the choice, you can join or keep left. Use them ears of yours. And keep the two second gap. What, so we're just staying in this lane? Yes, just keep left. When you've got the choice, the examiner's got to tell you what to do. Oh. So if, got, if it's joined the curve, he's not going to tell you, but if you've got a choice, he'll tell you. Keep the two second gap. Slow down a bit more and get that gap. Oh, when you fill breaks the two seconds, you're too close, you need a buckle. Line the back of the wagon over a white line. That's about two seconds, isn't it? Yes. Roundabout, we're going to turn right. It's the third exit for the year one, two, three, one. So I signal when I come up the line, ramp thing. When it, when it comes, it's, but don't signal here. It's splitting up there. Yeah, it does. See, it spirals out to the left now. I'll be ready, the could change. That means foot off gas. <laughs> so when I say be ready, that means take your foot off the I gas. Know, but why is he changing like two seconds after the went to green? So does that mean I can't rest my feet? Cause... Yeah. Which lane are you going to on the roundabout? Middle. middle. And then you know when you get round past the second exit, the middle one now becomes the left. It spirals out to the left, so you need to take the left again. Get ready to go now, because you're going to change. See the like tram lights, can't you? Just imagine you're driving a tram. Now take your foot off the gas and be ready. See what I mean? They don't stop on green very long, do they? Can I rest? Shall I go to neutral rest of your feet or not? Um, it's your choice. They're going to change soon. Watch for them slowing down to stop, and then you can get into first pretty. Now remember, it's going to spiral out to the left. So which lane you pick? Left. Good. And get ready. Don't rush. Nice and smooth. Now take your foot off the gas now. Don't want the gas. Now see, spiral out to the left. Get the left then. Left. That's it. So just come over to the left. There you go. Make 
do all the fast stuff when we do your mug tests. And I'm going to torture you for 40 minutes. No, I can't be bothered for that, mate. <laughs> now, left over it. Sing in the walk, that's it. Right, now, at the roundabout, we're turning right, third exit. Wow, they want these bars. I can't see. Well, you can see. Uh, no, it's shocking. But yeah, I can see that it's splitting up. So I want to choose middle lane. Yes, we can see, look. See the tram lines, the dotted lines. Yeah. yeah, you can see there, can't you? It's bad, they need to repaint these. It's alright for the experienced drivers who know these roads like the back of the hands. Can you? Flew back in. Don't hold, keep the right bit. See how it's split? Yeah, yeah. Now we want number three, that one's number one. Now be ready with the lights. Put your signal back on. Drifting in the middle of the left lane here. So the different lanes in front of you. Now see how it's spiralled out to the left now? Yeah. That's a bit easier, isn't it? Leave it in a second. Not this one, it's half a mile ahead. I don't know what's happened here, I don't know if it's there. Um... Leaving at this exit.
it's telling it's a dotted lane, so it's telling it's a separate runoff. Had it been lane dividers, you would have been in the left lane. if anybody's on the ticket. Wasn't if you can do this by roundabout on your own, if you get it right.
signal, it's all looking good, you've picked the crack lane, well done. Let's see if we can finish it off. That bank like lean over like that when you went wrong. That's like us and you're driving this and shit. I'm not. It's not parking brake on. Wow, well done, lad, well done. That's amazing. Well done. Well done. I'm checking your mirrors a bit there. Yeah, 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 I'm happy with that. It's really good. Got one more for you to do. Well done with that. Right. See how it spiraled out? Yeah. And then you had the choice on approach, you kept to the left of the two. It's good stuff that. spiral roundabout so if it splits into two lanes you know which one to pick up here yeah. so if you can do this one on your own now with the roundabout we're turning right it's the fourth exit you can cancel that so we're looking for Durham A690 it's right fourth exit see so if you can do it on your own Not 
done nothing wrong, but you make things harder for yourself now. See how it's split in the two yeah. lanes? Oh, well, you should have been, I'd have been where this white car is. I mean, you, you've done nothing wrong, but you're making things harder for yourself now. There's two forks on the gears. What? Uh -huh. Well, don't let one thing overshadow the other. I would have been focused on seeing if that split into two lanes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Better say you've done nothing wrong, but um, you count your exits also so you don't get. So you don't What's get the third exit? Fourth. Fourth. This one, I can keep away from it. I get past that. I was going down there. That's the uh, isn't it? I wouldn't have a signal for right now. Not the best, but we'll do. Um, you, could, you know, when you pass the third exit, yeah. what could you have done then? Moved over. Well, you could have moved over, couldn't you? But if you couldn't move over, you'd have to leave it the right lane and fill the back with the left. But on approach, you could have back off. On approach, you could have saved yourself a lot of hard work by just keeping to the left lane. Yeah.
should be in there. You've got to make use of them slip boards to get in and let the traffic on your right get past you. Can you see to the left? No. Would you not use that parking brake for? I didn't know. Because I didn't stop. Really? Did you not? No, way. I was trying to edge forward, but then I, as soon as I did edge forward, I could see straight away. Right. 
There you go. Well, there's nothing coming from right at all. You look like you two worried about this car. You worry about your right on them roundabouts. I was, mm. dre I was dreading that spiral roundabout thing. How do you think you've done them? I didn't do great, but I've done all right. For what we've done, the day, that was a really good lesson. Um, right, joining the dual carriageways. Um, what have you got to do with your speed? With it? Match theirs. Match theirs to their speed. And when you go into a three lane carriageway, what's the middle lane for? Overtake. When you do overtake, how do you know when to move back to the left? When you can see the car's headlights in your mirror, middle Good. mirror. And if someone overtakes you and they cut you up and come in a bit early, what gap have you got to do? Two second gap. And how do you judge that two second gap? By seeing it in your head or matching it with the markings on the road. To count the two seconds, yeah? What happens to the gap in wet weather? Doubles. Doubles? And when you leave a carriageway, if you're doing 70 miles an hour, when would you signal? The, th the first road marking. The 300 yard Three, one. Yeah. If you're doing 50? Second. When people want to join the dual carriageway, what three ways can you do with it? You can either keep going, like speed up, mm -hmm. slow down, or move over. Good. So we've done the joining, we've done the overtaking, we've done the two second gap, and we've done the leaving. Spiral roundabouts or giant toy roundabouts, whatever you want to call them. If you approach a roundabout and it splits, spirals out to the left, splits into two, which one's the best one to pick? Left. The left. What do you feel you need to improve on after the deer? Probably just looking at the road markings on the spiral roundabouts. Well, that's easy done then. For the first lesson on spiral roundabouts, it's pretty good. Um, right, fifth to six, look. Move your leg. What's the matter with that leg? Is that six? <laughs> Is it exactly? Wait, what was that? It, what, you were just putting it in in Europe? It's because I was so nervous because I'm on the thing. Well, that probably explains that then. That explains Wait, so this it. is six here? Yeah. yeah. Right, really? I don't know how I was cutting it up. In fourth to fifth, look? Nah, I think I've mastered that now, I think. Yeah. Right, things to improve on. Some of the, the lanes you were on, you were drifting, you're getting on the white line a little bit. That's down to your eyes, you need to keep your eyes moving. And anticipate the lights changing, will you? Yeah. You know when you come to lights, you're not know. coming off your gas, and know, they will change. But maybe it was just nerves, right? The videos for the maneuvers are not on the Facebook page. We're gonna, I'm gonna, I've got a little route for you to do on the motorways where motorways merge into one. It's very scary. It'll take us about half an hour and then we're going to move on to the maneuvers. Were you okay with that? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah? I'll send you the videos I want you to watch for the maneuvers. Um, just keep watching them until you just keep watching them until they sink in. Have you any questions before you go? No. Nope. But that was a good lesson, better lesson, well done. But you can tell you're really comfortable, can't you? Yeah, thank you. Right, I'll see you just the same time, yeah, next yeah. Wednesday? Yeah. yeah. So you know, I'm going to check this dormer. This dormer looks fine, man. Looks low to me. It's not. It was fine. Jump in. Shut that door, sorry. 
it was completely Give us a look. That's fine. Yeah, I, yeah, I yeah. sit up when I'm... All right, you're right. I'm wrong. See you later.